melon pan challenge. Wow! Oh, uh, hey fam, welcome back. This is another video. Let's do it. All right, in today's video, we are going to be discussing a very worrying trend that has happened on the internet this year. And um, no, I have not laughed at any of these videos once, okay? Trust me. <laughs> All right, so over the past few weeks, there is something that has gone viral and it's called the cheese slap challenge. It's pretty self-explanatory. You take some cheese, you slap it on someone's head and ha ha ha, laughs all around. Hmm. Well, the only problem is people are doing it to young children. Just quickly to summarize the young man challenge, basically what people would do is they would chuck items, doesn't matter what it was, at people right in the face, and they would do so to the beat of uh, the Village People's YMCA. So as soon as the beat where it goes, young man, as soon as that hits, it's like slap, bang, uh, I don't know, a piece of ham or a shoe goes straight into someone's head. And of course it goes without saying, this was uh, pretty stupid. For those of you out there that aren't five years old, this thing has taken off on TikTok and it is living its very best life on its own. And this has actually spawned something called the cheese slap challenge. Basically the same premise. Only thing is you swap out whatever item it was for cheese, okay? But the thing that has got people all up in a tizzy, all hot and bothered about this cheese slap challenge is the fact that people aren't doing it to their friends in high school or their co-workers at work. They are actually doing it to their uh, infant children, yes. Yes, they are throwing pieces of cheese at kids who, um, number one, don't know how to use a toilet, uh, number two, don't have a fully functioning brain, and number three, just go goo goo gaga, uh, baby want milk milk all day. These people, I shouldn't say people, these children, these poor, poor innocent children are getting <laughs> stinky dairy products thrown at their head by the people that they trusted and they love the most their parents. Now, I'm all for doing something really funny for views or for attention. That's fine. Hey, man, you got to do what you got to do in life to survive. But I question, is throwing cheese, especially American plastic cheese, at a kid, is that a good idea? Is that the best idea you can come up with? Well, guys, there you have it. Parenting 101. Is your kid crying? Eh, doesn't matter. Does your kid want attention? Eh, is your kid hungry? Eh, does your kid have a shitty diaper? Eh, don't worry about it. All your problems can be solved in one simple move. Cheese slap. And you can see by the kid's reaction, no idea what's happening. Hey Logan. <laughs> hey Benjamin, are you look hungry? Would you like cheese? Ah, uh, now some of the reactions of the kids are quite cute, so it, it, the challenge itself should not be taken too seriously. Shut up! But in all honesty though, the kids are probably just happy that they were given something to eat for free and they didn't have to do anything at all to earn it. Man, that is the world that I want to live in. I want to live in a world that gives you food for no reason. <laughs> One thing that I did notice with a few of these videos is when they do it to kids that are really, really young, um, the kid, as they just haven't formulated how to react in their head. So all they do is they just like, they just sit there and they're like, And the monster inside you cannot stop laughing, but the human exterior is like, um, uh, I kind of feel bad for laughing at this, but then again, I mean, oh man, this challenge is stupid. 
But as kids continue to grow older, they learn how to deal with problems and adversity in life. And this next video is the perfect example of how a kid was presented with an obstacle and how they overcame it. Yep, that 35 year old kid, they are a true inspiration to us all. Man, why are you gonna do him like that? I mean, he's just there trying to get some beauty sleep and you wanna make an absolute goose out of him. So rude. See, there you go, kids. That is the perfect example of how to handle a cheese slap challenge correctly. So all of you out there watching, I want you to start taking notes. I want you to grab a Crayola crayon. I want you to go over to the whitest wall in your house and I want you to jot down every little thing that I'm saying. Maxie, are you alright, baby? Corner of that plastic poison. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have cheese, I've only got ham. Hey, Rick? Rick? First of all, this kid is wearing a shirt saying I got my muscles from my daddy, so you know for a fact that this guy is not one to be messed with. <laughs> what, what bitch? Is that the best you got? Is that the best you've got? Let me look you dead ass in the eye and eat this damn cheese right now. Is that the best you've got? Really? Really? Uh, low key, I'm actually quite scared of that baby, so I'm not gonna be throwing cheese at any baby anytime soon. One, because I'm scared of babies. Two, because it's stupid. And three, because, um, I'm, I'm busy, I'm busy doing a video, so I can't, I can't do it. Now, I can completely understand when it's your own kid and you're concerned for them, that's good parent. But the secondhand offense that people have when they see someone else's kid getting a slice of cheese thrown at them, ah, uh, it's a bit much, you know what I'm saying? Can it be a rule that babies are left out of ridiculous social media challenges? Stop throwing cheese at their faces, it's not funny. Hmm, it's, a little bit funny. This cheese challenge is not funny. Your baby is unable to consent to this. I've seen videos of babies crying, the cheese hitting a baby in the eye, even a cheese slice covering the baby's nose and mouth. Stop it. Hashtag bad parenting. I don't think any parent wants to see their kid die from asphyxiation caused by a cheese slice. So I don't think it's really going to get to that point. I highly doubt that a uh, Slice of cheese is going to hit a baby in the face and the baby's going to be like, oh, I can't breathe. And the parents going to be like, ha, 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 yeah, that's right. Oh, look, Sharon, you can't breathe. Oh, this is going to be great. This is going to make such a great meme. Oh, 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 he's not moving. Oh, that's, hey, I mean, come on. Let's be real for a second. Like, I haven't seen any fatalities linked to the cheese slap challenge. So just cool your jets on that, please. I appreciate your concern. But again, ah, it's a just cheese. Warning, warning. This is distressing as it as shows. Whew. Warning, this is distressing as shows babies flinch with shock. Hmm, not as distressing as your grandma, miss. Imagine you are sitting quietly and suddenly a loved one flings something in your face. You could move or say something, these babies can't. Let's be clear, this is abuse. Hmm. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, if I had the choice of moving and not moving when I see an object come towards me, I'd like to be able to exercise my right to move out of the way, regardless of what the object is, so... Yeah, I agree. We need to stop this cheese slap challenge right now. I want everybody down in the comment section below to voice your outrage about the cheese slap challenge. I need you to say, man, young noodle arm bra, ah, uh, oh, I got cheese thrown at me the other day and I'm ready to leave home and I'm pretty sure I'm going to burn my family house down. That's how angry I am. I want everybody to be as outraged as everybody else on Twitter and let's just bind, let's, let's just get together. Ah! But seriously though, it's a harmless internet challenge. It's going to go 
go away in a few weeks. Yes, it's a bit dangerous, but it's fun at the end of the day. No one's died. Let's relax, everyone. Uh -huh. All right, guys, that's the end of the video. Please let me know what you think down in the comment section below. If you discover this video for some reason, why you sicko, why are you searching the cheese slap challenge, make sure you take the time to hit that subscribe button. Maybe ring the bell to stay notified so you can get more videos like this about cooked content from me on the daily. Just kidding, on the weekly at this point. Uh, but that's it. I love you all. Drop a like, blah, 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 all that. I'll see you later. Love you all. Bye.